Takuma Ino might seem like a loose thread, but pull him tight and you'll discover a character woven with quiet determination and strategic brilliance. He's not the loudest voice in the classroom, but his unwavering ambition to rise through the ranks of jujutsu sorcerers burns with the intensity of an Olympic athlete's dream. His compass? The calm demeanor and tactical mind of senior sorcerer Kento Nanami, a beacon guiding Ino's every step. This isn't just hero worship, it's a masterclass in learning, a testament to Ino's dedication to improvement beyond personal glory. In a world of flashy powers, Ino's journey is a refreshing whisper of perseverance, dedication, and the quiet courage that lies beneath the surface. But before we get into it, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And if you want to get notified every time I upload a new video, click the bell icon as well. It really helps me out and I appreciate it a lot. All right, let's get started. In the intricate tapestry of Jujutsu Kaisen, Takuma Ino may seem like a supporting thread, but he adds essential color and texture to the narrative. His character is like that one student in class who isn't the loudest, but has a quiet determination that can't be ignored. Ino's background as a jujutsu sorcerer is rooted in his connection to the Tokyo Metropolitan Magic Technical College and his ambition to rise to a grade one sorcerer. It's a classic tale of aiming high, akin to an aspiring athlete dreaming of the Olympics. A defining aspect of Ino's character is his profound admiration for Kento Nanami, a senior jujutsu sorcerer. This admiration isn't just fanboy enthusiasm, it's a guiding beacon for his career path. Ino looks to Nanami much like a young apprentice would to a master craftsman, seeking to emulate his calm demeanor and strategic approach to conflicts. His respect for Nanami is not only about his strength, but also his values and methodology. It's as if Ino is constantly taking mental notes, hoping to incorporate these lessons into his own jujutsu journey. Ino's aspirations go beyond personal glory. He embodies the spirit of growth and learning, striving to improve not just for the sake of ranking, but to genuinely contribute to the jujutsu world. His journey is peppered with challenges, much like an underdog story, where each hurdle is an opportunity to learn and become better. This quest for improvement is relatable and adds a layer of depth to his character. With a demeanor that's more contemplative than flamboyant, Eno represents the hard-working individuals who quietly, yet persistently, work towards their goals. He's the embodiment of the saying, still waters run deep. In the bustling world of Jujutsu Kaisen, where flashy powers often steal the spotlight, Ino's character is a refreshing presence that highlights the power of perseverance, dedication, and the quieter form of courage. Ino in the Shibuya Arc. In the Shibuya Arc of Jujutsu Kaisen, a pivotal saga teeming with high-stakes battles and character development, Takuma Ino steps out of the background and into the spotlight. His involvement in this arc is akin to a supporting actor who delivers a scene-stealing performance, proving that even side characters can have their moment of glory. Ino's role in the Shibuya arc showcases his growth and evolving leadership qualities. Thrust into the chaos of the Shibuya incident, he doesn't just survive, he adapts and thrives. Imagine being an understudy suddenly called to take the stage on opening night and then delivering a performance that wows the audience. That's Eno in this arc. He navigates through the complexities of the situation with a level-headedness that belies his lower rank. His interactions with major characters such as Kento Nanami, Yuji Itadori, and Megumi Fushiguro highlight his ability to work collaboratively and make crucial decisions under pressure. Ino's relationship with Nanami, in particular, is further developed here, providing a deeper insight into his aspirations and learning process. He observes and learns from Nanami's actions, 
much like a protege learning from a master in the heat of battle. In the Shibuya arc, Ino also demonstrates his strategic acumen. He's not the most powerful sorcerer on the battlefield, but he compensates with intelligence and adaptability. It's like a chess player who, lacking powerful pieces, uses pawns in the most effective and unpredictable ways. His ability to assess situations and react accordingly showcases a maturity that goes beyond his years and experience. While Takuma Ino may not be the flashiest sorcerer in Jujutsu Kaisen, his Jujutsu abilities and combat skills are akin to a Swiss army knife in the toolkit of a sorcerer. They are versatile, practical, and surprisingly effective when deployed strategically. Ino's signature technique, the Auspicious Beast Summon, is a prime example of his resourceful approach to combat. The Auspicious Beast Summon allows Eno to call forth animal spirits to aid him in battle. It's like having a team of specialized assistants, each with a unique skill set. These summons range from reconnaissance and support to direct combat roles, making Eno a well-rounded fighter who can adapt to various situations. His technique is reminiscent of a skilled orchestra conductor, seamlessly integrating different elements to create a harmonious battle strategy. Eno's combat style reflects his pragmatic and analytical nature. He doesn't charge headlong into battles. Instead, he assesses the situation, identifies his opponent's weaknesses, and tailors his strategy accordingly. This approach is like a chess player carefully considering each move, anticipating the opponent's response, and strategically positioning his pieces for maximum effect. Moreover, Eno's abilities demonstrate the significance of tactical thinking over brute force in the Jujutsu world. In a universe where overwhelming power often takes the spotlight, Eno's style is a reminder of the power of strategy, intelligence, and adaptability. He's the embodiment of the adage, work smarter, not harder, utilizing his skills in the most effective and efficient ways possible. Takuma Ino's role in Jujutsu Kaisen may initially seem modest, but his impact and potential for future storylines are like hidden gems waiting to be uncovered. Ino, with his understated yet steady presence, adds a rich layer of depth to the series' narrative much like a skilled supporting actor who subtly enhances a film's overall texture. Eno's impact in the series is multifaceted. He represents the everyday sorcerer, not endowed with extraordinary powers or a dramatic backstory, yet he contributes significantly to the narrative. His character brings a sense of realism and relatability to the world of Jujutsu. Eno is like the everyman hero, the character the audience can see themselves in, navigating a world of chaos and power with determination and a strong moral compass. Looking ahead, Ino's future potential in Jujutsu Kaisen is ripe with possibilities. He's the epitome of an underdog whose journey to greatness is not just about gaining power, but also about personal growth and resilience. In a series where power dynamics and epic battles often take center stage, Eno's progression provides a refreshing narrative of personal development and the triumph of the human spirit. His future could involve significant character arcs where he takes on more prominent roles, perhaps even surprising fans with unforeseen abilities or strategic brilliance. Moreover, Eno's character could be pivotal in exploring themes like the value of non-elite sorcerers in the Jujutsu world, challenging the existing hierarchy and notions of strength. His journey could inspire other characters and impact the broader storyline, showing that strength comes in many forms and often from the most unexpected places. Takuma Eno's story, like a slow-burning ember, ignites into possibility in the Shibuya arc. Thrust into the crucible of chaos, he emerges not just unscathed, but refined. His leadership qualities bloom, strategic mind shines, and unwavering loyalty to Nanami deepens. 
He wields his auspicious beast summon like a virtuoso, orchestrating a symphony of combat amidst the cacophony of curses. Eno's rise isn't about brute force. It's about meticulous planning, tactical brilliance, and the quiet confidence of a rising star. He serves as a stark reminder that power comes in many forms, that the unassuming rain can nurture a hidden storm. As Jujutsu Kaisen unfolds, keep your eyes on Takuma Ino, for his journey is far from over. The potential that simmered beneath the surface is now bubbling over, promising to surprise and inspire in equal measure. If you like what I do in here, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.